supporting men's health for Movember this week on The Wire. Returning expats boost markets, millions plan to buy in 2021, and loan deferral numbers improve. G'day guys, my name's Tim Guest, and welcome to The Wire, the week in real estate, where you can get all the top stories happening this week in finance, real estate, investment, and more. Now please like, comment, share this video, and if it's your first time tuning in, don't forget to follow or subscribe wherever you are seeing this. So let's kick it off with our top story for this week, returning expats boost markets. So demographic experts say that we are due for a migration tsunami, which will lead to extremely high housing demand. Now, while immigration is stagnant, the return of the Aussie expat is compensating. Returning expats can now return home even sooner under the federal government's expanding quarantine process in Dar processing, I should say, in Darwin, set to process around 1,000 expats a month. Now, almost half a million Australians have already returned home in the past year, mostly due to the pandemic, and the Department of Foreign Affairs has revealed another 36,000 Australians have registered interest in coming home. And this is an unprecedented spike in returning expats. According to the ABS, the 2019 financial year saw Australia's population increase by almost 240,000 people due mainly to net overseas migration. Now, the main amount of returning expats has already exceeded this so far this financial year, and experts predict millions of prospective future Aussies are waiting in the wings to relocate here as soon as possible, seeking to flee countries that have escalating health or political risks. Now guys, for our next story, millions plan to buy in 2021. So house hunting has hit fever pitch in Australia amid a remote working revolution. That's according to research by comparison website Finder. Its survey reveals that one in five are looking to purchase a property in the next 12 months. Now that's equivalent to 3.8 million people planning to buy real estate in the near future. CoreLogic data shows that regional property values are continuously outperforming those in capital cities as an increasing number of city slickers seek out a tree change while working from home. Kate Brown, personal finance expert at Finder, says the results indicate that a post-pandemic housing boom is on the horizon. She says there is a good chance we will see a deluge of people searching for properties from those trying to get their foot in the market to seasoned upgraders. Potential buyers could experience a shortage of listings and a spike in home values as demand outstrips supply. Our finders at research found that more males, that's 23% of males, than females, 17%, have their sights set on building property and around a third of millennials are hoping to enter the market. Now guys, for our final story of the week, loan deferral numbers improve. So the steady reduction in loan deferral numbers provides further evidence of the improvement in the economy and property markets, says the Real Estate Institute of Australia. Australian Banking Association figures show the number of deferred loans has fallen below 300,000, a reduction of nearly 70% from the peak of the pandemic when more than 900,000 loans were deferred. REIA President Adrian Kelly says the data is positive news for property markets as it signals the minimisation of forecasted financial problems. He says this is good news for those living in investment properties as it provides increased security to tenants. It also means catastrophic forecasts for Australian housing markets made at the start of a pandemic are simply not coming to fruition. Kelly says uh, the Australian Prudential Regulation Authority data shows the overall levels of household saving in Australia increased from March through to October, which continues to indicate a strengthening of household balance sheets. Well guys, they're the top stories for the week. Now please, don't forget to like, comment and share this video and follow and subscribe uh, wherever you are seeing this. Have a great weekend guys and remember there is only one thing in life that makes a difference and that's action. Thanks a lot and bye for now.